Scottish Award winning comic and author, all the way from Glasgow. Very, very funny lady. Janie Godley, ladies and gentlemen. And this is my fifth time, so I'll win the return voucher. Lovely, love it here. You guys are awesome. Um, love your beaches. We don't have them in Scotland. Seriously, it's just a strip of stones with a white high heel and a used condom. <laughs> you go for a swim and your arm gets caught in a bike. It's just, and you're not a fridge. You guys are beautiful. And it's lovely being here. And, and you know, I wanted to tell you things. I'm 48. Yeah. Don't cheer, it's quite old. <laughs> I've been married 30 years, and people say, Janie, how do you keep sex alive? Well, I touch other men. Um, <laughs> keeps it quite funky for me. You have to just accept some things when you're 48. Do you remember when you were younger, you laughed like this? <laughs> no, you laugh like this. <laughs> <laughs> yes, suck up my pain. <laughs> I'm joking, I've done the exercises, I'm fine. But <laughs> there comes a point when you're 48 and my daughter still lives at home. Who here has got 20-year-olds that still live at home? Yeah, it's horrible, isn't it? My daughter still lives at home. She's convinced there's a bank account she hasn't drained yet, you know? <laughs> and you know that way when you've been married a long time and we did that thing, my husband and I, when we just wanted to, you know, just casual sex. Remember in the 80s, you could throw your leg up, all oh, that hurt, right? <laughs> now you're like, that's an achievement, right? <laughs> Seriously, and you just want to have casual sex. And my husband and I we were in bed, and Ashley was out in the hall putting on makeup because that's her job. I don't know, right? <laughs> and him and I are doing that. You know the one I'm talking about when you're going, you move, put your arm like that. Just don't, no, don't get, get your chin out of there. What's that? Just don't. Oh, move your leg. Take the weight on your elbows. Oh, get off my <laughs> You know, because if my daughter hears us having sex, she's mentally damaged, you know? <laughs> and we're doing this. <laughs> oh, stupid Catholic. <laughs> and then in the middle of it all, we're finally getting there, and he goes, Ah! My daughter's like, What's up with my dad? I went, I'm having sex, and I think he's had a stroke. Right? My husband's jumped out the bed, going, Ah! My leg's in a cramp! <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> Just perfect. And of course, it's different in our day, back in the 60s, when you think when your mother was there. Who here is over 40? Give me a yeah. yeah. Who here would have said back in the day to their mum, shut it, you bitch? <laughs> no, <laughs> you wouldn't. Because in the 60s, if I had said to my mum, Shut up, you big bitch. My mum would have come out the next day and said, Our Janie died in a chip pan fire. <laughs> in her bed. <laughs> she just heated up her chip pan and went, Really? <laughs> Imagine kicking your mum in the street. Your mum would have just went, Hang on a minute, Agnes. I love coming back here. And you guys were all excited because you thought I was Susan Boyle, didn't you? <laughs> yeah. I'm Susan Boyle. I've had my, my eyebrows plucked and my moustache done and you should see my cat. I've had my pussy trimmed and everything. <laughs> Poor Susan, God love her. And Susan Boyle said to the world that she'd never been kissed, but I'm no advertising. <laughs> I think you'll find you just have, Susan. <laughs> She says she'd never been kissed, and the world's press said that Susan Boyle, the Scottish singing sensation, was a virgin. Trust me, Scottish men will fuck you without kissing you, okay? <laughs> you guys are brilliant, my show's at the